35 Texas hook'em. Brandon's 56, taking six, man. Hey, if we see 56 way tomorrow, over. you'll know. We, that's what I mean. We know we're something serious then if that happens. It He's could, going it could way happen. over. It could happen. I actually I haven't said this yet. I was saving it for later, but I think – I think uh, because – I, tr- I tried to be as a objective, but also as non wishy washy when I'm on here as possible, especially on my channel too. So I like to come out and just be, be straight up with it, right? Um, I think I think Texas wins big tomorrow, but that's just my unexpert opinion. Why? I can't really describe. A lot of it has to do with the coaching staff and what I talked about, just what we're seeing from special teams, like we're seeing the culture change kind of right before our eyes. And personally, I think after being embarrassed on national television in Fayetteville, I think that we saw, we don't win, we don't win conference games the way that we won last week. Like the dark decade of Texas, this last, these last 10 years, that doesn't happen. And to me, you just see a statement like that when you control a game completely. Like, when's the last time you actually sat and watched a Texas game and didn't really have to worry about it? Especially in conference. Comp- uh, yeah. So, I don't know, man. I, I just, I, to me, it feels different. I can't ex- really necessarily explain why. I laid out some of the things, again, like with, with the coaching staff. Like, it's, it's you, everybody loved Tom Herman, right? We were saying before Tom Herman was brought in, and I hate to go back, like continue harping on the past, but just to kind of make my point clear here, we've our 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 talking point, the the way we attack that angle of yes, we got Tom Herman was what was it? It was LSU wanted him. That was our validation. That was how we've you know we validated that move for more or less, right? When you see a coaching staff made up of members with the resume like this one is made up with everybody can't like you've got predominantly Alabama University of Alabama that's Steve Sarkeesian's staff with along with Pete Kwiatkowski Tom Herman it was predominantly the University of Houston good old G5 coaches so I said this again to recently I don't remember who or where but I was like I've 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 learned as a fan I've I've tried to separate bias and look at things objectively, and that's part of the learning curve. As as a fan, you go through lulls and ebbs and flows of of with your teams, and you start to learn what what really matters, what's what's really not important. And to me, the coaching staff is just like it's different to me. So I just I I, I don't know. I got that gut feeling, man. We'll see. We'll see. Talk is cheap. <laughs>